exciting stuff guys as logitech silently or should i say a chinese retailer breaks the news logitech is releasing a updated version of the old old time legend the mx518 it's gonna be called mx518 legendary and it's releasing pretty soon there's a lot to talk about guys let's dig into it Hey, how is it going guys? Robin here on Chips Entertainment, bringing you the best tips and tools for gaming on this channel. You'll find PC components, tech gadgets, and console accessories, as well as product reviews and even unboxings. So if you're interested in that, consider subscribing and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any uploads. Now, I was jumping up and down when I heard about this and I figured, let's share the brilliant news, right? It is Monday after all right anyway i just want to start by saying i'm glad you made it here now obviously i'm gonna order this mouse as soon as it becomes available so if you're curious and you want to find out more about it before possibly ordering one yourself don't worry guys i will keep you covered here in traditional chef's flick and style i'm gonna do the unboxing and i'm gonna do a review on this mouse as well Hopefully answering every single tiny question you guys might have here. So, anyone that isn't too familiar with this mouse first... What the fuck? I mean, sorry, I couldn't resist. Anyway, this is one hell of a mouse. It is a legend and a veteran, if you like. Long story short, the original MX518 from Logitech is based on the MX510 that is based on the mx500 it came out back in the beginning of 2000 so it's a mouse that is based on a design that came out almost 20 years ago pretty wicked anyway it got picked up by gamers pretty quickly as soon as it released on the market now it's not like there wasn't any mice available on the market back then but there wasn't a whole lot of gaming oriented mice uh really not a whole lot that would interest gamers so when this came out people were excited now i want to know in the comments guys can you relate to do you remember this time let me know i'm super curious to know that now what gamers fell in love with wasn't just the amazing optical sensor here or the incredible button switches but it was also the layout and more importantly the magnificent shape the design and this is what it looked like i actually got one uh since i'm a gamer a geek and a old time csgo player i was using this every single day playing csgo 1.6 and even 1.5 it's still to this day pretty marvelous and i'm curious to uh I wonder if this actually work. We gotta try it super quick. I, uh, I'm just curious to know. Let's see. So it seems like the sensor is actually working. And there we go. I'm super happy that they are finally taking the step to uh, actually remake and relaunching this mouse again. Now, we need to talk about the specs, right? It seems like they're going with an Hero 16K sensor, which is an optical sensor. And if I'm not totally mistaken, it's based on the hero sensor right it wouldn't make any sense otherwise and that sensor is actually based on the uh, pixart pmw3366 sensor which is a fantastic sensor now 16k indicate that this will have a maximum dpi of 16k right which is plenty even if you're sitting on an 8k monitor i guess anyway we got release date on the october 15th which is pretty soon and i cannot wait for this date now these news all came through a um, chinese retailer um you can check out some screens here guys this is what it looks like you can order it now if you live in china unfortunately i don't it will retail for 2.99 yen and uh, if we translate this into american dollars it turns out to be how much 40 bucks around 40 bucks or 34 euros 
ish literally jumping up and down as i'm reading through this and i can't wait for the 15th of uh, october already now if you've been a gamer for a long time you probably once or at least twice heard about this mouse everyone had one or at least someone in your surrounding had one uh, <laughs> mine obviously haven't aged very well too much csgo and wow uh, had his toll on this puppy but yeah hopefully i think the newer one will have a better cord. Now, anyway, guys, I'm curious to know, are you still using your good old MX 518, your 5, 510, or even the 500? Again, I am going to cover the, uh, the new Logitech MX 518 Legendary as soon as it drops on the market. Yeah, guys, that's basically it. Just a small update video. I hope you enjoyed. And thank you so much once again for watching this video. Cannot thank you guys enough for the support. You are amazing, alright? See you guys in the next one. Have an awesome day, alright? Bye.